to do. They have nothing to lose, Scott. Yeah, high vibe with this team. The culture's fantastic. They've won five straight in this building. Cowboys control. Khalifa, too strong. Fence was right there, and John Michael Wright resets. Oh, the gutty senior to the hole. The kids haven't figured it out yet. <laughs> Another miss by BYU. Cowboys, step back, small. Drains it. Slicing to the hole, puts it in reverse. Kicks it to Keon Williams. He snaps it cross court for Keller. Extra pass for Wright. Drains it. Pass too many. Williams couldn't grab it. BYU 0 for 3, 3 turnovers. Can Waterman change it? No. Here's Dallin Hall. Finds Khalifa wide open. Tees it up. Knocks. Small. Loves contact. Keller, the freshman. Wide left. Defense. Noah Waterman from the corner. Rims out. Try it again. Yeah. Against Texas Tech. 1 of 10 to start the game on Tuesday night. John Michael Wright, who just made his 301st three-pointer earlier. Don't line jump him. Watch out. You get excited talking about the big guys, don't you? I've been watching that big fellow the last two weeks now. Another big. Khalifa controls. Here's Trevin now. Pump fake. Pulls up at the free throw line. Back to Khalifa. Can he hit another three? Here's into the basketball game alongside Jackson Robinson. Dallin Hall, extra pass. Trevin now off the iron. Gets it right back. Over his head, Coogs take it away again. Here's Jackson Robinson showing off that body. Oklahoma State not throwing enough bodies onto the glass. One of the things they pride themselves is getting on the offensive glass. But look at the speed. He looks like Batman right there. The Super Friends in action. 10-2 BYU run. Garrison. Hustles throw that little baby hook over his left shoulder. John Michael Wright. He has been deadly from three on the season. Go right now, real cold from the outside. Got to drive that ball inside. One of their last ten. Robinson, he wants to get a victory his, in his senior night here on his last game at the Marriott Center. Williams finger roll good. Small off the dribble, three try, no good. Nine newcomers is always a difficult thing to try to get everybody on the same page. Then you got injuries on top of it. But look at Jackson Robinson down there. He's got the build for the, uh, the next level as well. Completes the... Saunders looking for three, too strong. A little bit more execution. Backdoor cut. Nice move by Daly for his team on senior night. You know, Mark Pope, he started a lot for us in the playoffs, and we were in Orlando Magic. We put him on there. That's Ali Khalifa. Drink. Too strong. Gets his own rebound. Daly feeling it right now. Right into the teeth of the bench he scores. Really did take that from the left wing, and in a blink of an eye was at the basket. Three point advantage for the Cougs is seven. Dallin Hall. Such great anticipation and vision. Gets it to Khalifa who drops it off for daylight. Shot clock at five. Nice look by Garrison. Better finish. Basketball twice now on back to back door cutters. Second assist of the night for Garrison. Triore gonna try his hand against him. Small shakes and bakes. Keller again right to like a shark. Goes to the hole, has it denied. Keon Williams in the open floor. Dipsy do high off the glass. Good. Dallin Hall, you want to talk about God-given vision. Mark Pope says he's got it. Nice ball. Ball to the basket. We talked about small several times in this. Give Jensen a lot of credit moving his feet, playing without fouling. Dallin Hall pulls the trigger. Hickman, if he gets space, he will launch. Goes downstairs to Garrison for the time being. Mid range J. Inside of a minute left in the first half. Richie Saunders fakes and penetrates. Smells blood in the season. Keon Williams, tightly wound spin move, kicks it to Daly, hammers it up. Waterman will hoist it. 
Robinson, can he get it off? He can. No, but Lake City, is that a possibility? And would the committee do that? Maybe it would give him too much an advantage. What are your thoughts or experience on that? Because the regionals, the second weekend is Thursday, Saturday, or the East in Boston. So it's Las Vegas or Boston. Pittsburgh. Now, I realize one is not very close to the other, but uh, it's quite possible. And Teams in the Big 12. <laughs> You have nine of them in right now, looking in when the tournament begins. You're the only one. A little bracketology session from the man, the myth, the legend, Joel. As well, BYU Cougars looking real good coming out of the locker room in the second half. Johnson walks the tightrope to two. I think their strength is getting to that basket. Behind the back. Khalifa can't deny the opportunity. Playing well, flexing his muscles in the interior. Eric Daly, a real bright spot for the Cowboys and for the season. They are staring down the barrel of a five or four seed. Johnson from three. Swish. Inside of 10 on the shot clock. Garrison has shown the mid-range touch. Bodies with Keller. Three, not. They don't come out on him. He knocks down a jump shot. They come out on him. Now all of a sudden, he can learn to a baseline. This guy's a future's real bright for that young big man. And the lead now. Cougars on fire shoot 83% here in the second half. A perfect 4-4 from behind the arc. Triori on the inside. Absor Connor Dow into the basketball. Game moves it to small. Small pump face. Penetrates up and under. Eric Daly. Oh, he has been boys a little juice coming out of the locker room. We haven't seen it, but boy, did he have a, another spectacular move around the basket. Triore. Speaking. Keller. Up and under finishes and quiets the crowd. Downstairs where Triore has been lethal. The meat hook. Keller can't get it to go down. Robinson. Coogs trying to make the lead 20 or more. Spencer Johnson floats it to Richie Saunders, who elevates here. Another takeaway for BYU. Floats it down low for Triori, who somehow comes down. And for those teams that are so hungry that want to have the upset against a Carolina or a Duke or a NC State, that's what Houston and Iowa State are going to end that second, in the second half. And how about we talk to Joe Lenardi, the possibility of them playing the first and second rounds in Salt Lake City. He said, bench for the Cowboys. Small from three hits. He knocked down another triple. He's been getting this point, but mostly by driving it inside. One of the few outside shots he's got is a big. I'll tell you what, I wouldn't want to get in the way of that big man when he's drop stepping hard to the rack like that. Small, nice job absorbing the to make matters worse for Oklahoma State. Small and his teammates. Eric Daly. Oh, he has the Cowboys a little juice coming out of the locker room. We haven't seen it, but boy, did he have a, another spectacular move around the basket. Triore. <laughs> Keller. Up and under finish. It was at four of their last five shots. Dallin Hall with that incredible vision. He's like a hawk finds Waterman. Downstairs where Triore has been lethal. The meat hook. Keller can't get it to go down. Robinson. Coogs trying to make the lead 20 or more. Spencer Johnson floats it to Richie Saunders, who elevates this year. Another takeaway for BYU. Floats it down low for Triori, who somehow comes down and goes. Teams that are so hungry that want to have the upset against a Carolina or a Duke or a NC State. That's what Houston and Iowa State are going to end that second, in the second half. And how about we talk to Joe Lenardi, the possibility of them playing the first and second rounds in Salt Lake City. He said, <laughs> for the Cowboys.
Small from three. Hits. He knocked down another triple. He's been getting his points, but mostly by driving it inside. One of the few outside shots. He's got it to pick. Tell you what, I wouldn't want to get in the way of that big man when he's drop stepping hard to the rack like that. Small, nice job absorbing the cut. To make matters worse for Oklahoma State, Small and his teammates shoot. That's some guy to be cool to go break some bread with. In the corner, Small tee it up. Connor Dow comes up with the takeaway. Yeah, Garrison getting down low, getting the uh, bending those legs and knocking that ball away. Hey. Khalifa. Hall will try to beat the shot clock and dunk. Small, the lone upperclassman on the floor right now for Oklahoma State. The McD can do it now at 245. Hey, I got to go back to Dallin Hall and Ali on that time uh, on the shot clock and how long it's going to take one of their partners to hoist up a triple. Hall fighting to the end. It's McBride, can he trim the lead to 10? Bends his knees and the freshman from Plano. 10 on the shot clock. Dallin Hall activates. Threads the needle to Triore. Makes no mistake. Hoop and then pull it back out. Hall with six assists tonight says, I'll go to the 10 this time. Challenge the. Small trying to settle things down. Elevates, drops it in. He defense rims out. 15 point advantage now for BYU. Can the Cowboys cut into it? Wow. Small playing big all night. Comes down and cans a triple. He has been huge. 25 points now for that young man. Fine. Oh no. Three points. 15 to play. Looks like they're going to get it. Pressure extended. Richie Saunders. And and an amazing fight tonight for Oklahoma State. Oh, Mr. Small. We've said it. Inside of 30 seconds. Jackson Robinson trying to get his money. Five seconds left, and these guys are playing till the absolute finish. And that will be. After he got whistled in, the officials were quick to team up for the victory. Mark Pope embraces Mike Boynton. Avenging a loss on February 17th in Stillwater to the Cowboys. Winning tonight 85 to 71 on Spencer Johnson. We take a look, there is an opportunity if Oklahoma State can be victorious in the early game of the first round on Tuesday afternoon. Win six straight to finish the year for BYU. 85 to 71. All we can say now is Kansas City, here we come.